Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. As always, I really, really appreciate it. If this is your first time here, welcome. I am Jenny. For today's video, I am going to be showing you guys how I use the brand new We Dad by face spray to retouch my curls. I've been using it for like about two weeks now. I have a little bit of a unique twist to how I've been using it. So I hope that you guys enjoy it. I hope that you guys get something from it. Before we actually jump into the tutorial, I wanna tell you a little bit about the product. So this spray is actually an addition to their advanced climate control line. Welcome to the family. Yay! The main purpose of this spray is to refresh your curls. Let me go ahead and read to you guys what they have to say about the product. Our Restorative by Face Spray combines two performing formulas in one to reactivate frizz-free curl definition as it nourishes and hydrates. Reactivates curl definition and restores luster for day one shine. Eliminates frizz and flyaways. Sounds pretty great to me. <laughs> All right, so it says here that this product comes in two sizes. It comes in the one ounce, this little baby right here, and it also comes in the 6.8 ounce bottle, which is this big old one right here. The suggested retail price for the one ounce is $12, and for the 6.8 ounces is $32. This is a little bit more on the pricey side. So now that we've covered the basics about the product, anything I missed, I'm gonna go ahead and add to the description box below, so you can go ahead and check that out. But let's go ahead and jump straight into the tutorial. Alrighty guys, so I actually went to sleep with my hair like this, woke up, left it like that, did my makeup, the whole shebang. Let's go ahead and take this off. I always feel so funny when I take off my pineapples. <laughs> the first thing I'm gonna do is before I put any product, before I put any water, I'm actually going to diffuse my hair. I like to do this because I feel like diffusing my hair before I get into any products helps me to sort of really visualize the state and condition of my hair. I find that diffusing my hair uh, loosens up the curls. Right here, you see how like this is very like pushed back because of the pineapple. I feel like diffusing it is gonna soften that up. It's just going to give me a more natural look to my curls. And it also does help to pinpoint where the real frizz is. Okay, so I'm gonna actually go in with medium heat. Now my suggestion is if you are still working on your curl health and you are still sort of like in your transitioning period, avoid any heat. So you might wanna try the cool setting. Whew. Now at this point, I feel like I have a better idea where my curls are frizzy and where they're not. Immediately, I can already tell that like this entire section right here needs some major TLC, some loving. Do you guys see how that's like really frizzy? Also right here. We're gonna go ahead and start with the way that they're suggesting it just because this is going to give us an overall refreshed, shiny look to the curls. Okay, so now that we have sprayed that all over our hair, let's go ahead and do the scrunching. So at this point, you would either diffuse or you would let your hair air dry, whichever way you prefer. Now, this isn't the only thing that we could do with this product and that's what I love. So what I've been doing is spray it on my hand and I actually go over each individual curl that I feel needs some leaven. I'm searching for the lost and found But you don't care, you're unaware Keep moving like the scars aren't even there It's in the air, like a blazing flare Just stare, cause the flames will burn us I thought you were the one for me That's why I give you everything Held you close by the stormy seas Oh, you meant the world to me
so sometimes a little trick that at least works for me is whenever I have straggler frizz where it's like frizz where I feel like it belongs to no one <laughs> But what I like to do is I like to finger twirl it attached to another curl and I feel like it forces it into the shape of the other curl. Alright, so you see how now it's more of a united curl? Okay, so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to diffuse my hair again. This is going to dry up those curls and give me an even better idea at which curls still need some retouching. Now that I finished diffusing, I don't know if you guys could now start to see that these curls have a lot more definition than they did when I first started this video. Okay, so this one I feel right here is being very rebellious. So I'm going to go in with water just so that I can reactivate the product that's already there. And just so we're not wasteful with our product. Because I know these things are expensive. <laughs> Now I have water and I'm just re-wetting that one curl. Okay, so right now I'm still just using water because I want to reactivate all that product that we have. This is probably my favorite way right now of like touching up my curls. I feel like the combination for me of the Biface spray combined with water, it gives me everything I want to touch up my curls because the Bifrae spray gives me so much shine, so much shine, and it really helps me with the spiral of my curl, which sometimes when I only touch up with water, although there's product there, it dilutes it, so I have a more loose curl, and I don't always like that because I know that it will get frizzy faster. When I combine the, the Bifrae I have such a hard time saying that. The bi-phase spray. <laughs> when I combine that with water, the way I'm showing you guys, I feel like it's perfect. It's perfect. I'm getting everything that I need and want for my second, third, fourth, fifth day hair. All right, guys. So now I'm going to go back and diffuse some more. Alrighty, I think we are done. I think that the only thing that I personally would do now is pick. I know, you're probably like, really Jenny? Like who spends all their time getting rid of frizz to then go back in and pick it? I know, I know. Yay, I'm super happy with the results. Remember guys, when you're touching up cur your curls, perfection is not the goal. First of all, I should never try to achieve perfect curls because I'm not even quite sure what that is. The goal is to just make the curls look better, not perfect. So don't lose your mind over it. Just as long as, you know, they look a little better, then that's all that matters. <laughs> Alrighty guys, so that's pretty much it for today's video. I really hope that you enjoyed it. I hope that you enjoyed my personal twist on the product. Let me know if you guys try anything you saw in this video. I would love to know if you guys have any questions that I can help you with. Let me know in the comment section below. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't done so already. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and I will see you in my next one. Bye! <clears throat> Face, face, I can never see that. Suggesting. Blah, blah, blah.